Hello and welcome everybody back to my channel. My name is Mike Wheeler. I am blinded. I'm living my best blind life to the fullest. So today we are going to be doing an unboxing of my Wewalk Smart Cane. This right here that you've seen in my previous video, my, my thank you video of me saying thank you to everybody that helped me receive this plus also others that helped you have the receipt get theirs well i got mine in let's unbox it first we open up the box and there are instruction papers for the the side that can still read and then there are braille ones unfortunately i can't read braille with my fingers and stuff like that but there are braille instructions too that come with it which is very awesome put that back in there okay all right first thing we're going to pull out and this is what the box comes in. It comes in a nice little styrofoam box. Comes styrofoam, holds everything in place. The lid has styrofoam on it also. First thing that we're gonna pull, I'm gonna pull out is the extendable cane itself. It's a nice, sturdy, um, collapsible cane. And it has a um, marshmallow tip right here. I'm not personally not a big fan of marshmallow tips. I will be changing this out. So you will not be seeing this tip in later episodes of my experience with my Wu Um, Then there is this little screw McGee right here. This right here will actually use what will screw the, um, the actual Wee Walk cane itself screws in onto the cane. So that's going to be exciting. I'll show you guys how that works. All right. Next we have in the box is a... Um, USB charging port for the wall. It is for the cane itself because the cane is electronic. And let's see, we also have a uh, wrist strap, which can also be used for the, um, to hold the cane together while it, when it's collapsed. Let's see what else we have in here. We have, it comes with a charging cable, which this is a micro USB to a USB, wherever the other end is, there it is, to another USB that comes along with it. Also in here we have a um, uh, earpiece that will connect to your phone via Bluetooth. It has a little clip onto it, put it like that. Um, it sits right around your ear because the cane is accessible for um, uh, assistance, which is in, uh, which is in demo right now. So it's not that accessible, but they're working on it. It comes with some more, um, ear length, ear things behind it and another ear piece or thing to go on the ear. Put that back in the box. It does come with another screw on. So you can attach it to, if you have another cane or anything like that, you just stick the, the elastic band through here, tie it in a knot, cut it, and you can put it on your own cane, which is really cool. Okay, now let's get to the fun part. This is the actual handle itself. As I, sh as I showed you on the cane, there is this screw and thing, it'll screw in right here. And then this is the handle, it has a nice little grip on it. It's nice and sturdy. Um, up here, right here, this little thing right here, this is where you will put the wristband, the, oh, where'd you go? Ah. This is where you will put the wrist strap on it. On the back side, on it, behind it, is where you would charge it in at. So it's really cool, it's out of the way. These buttons, right, this right here, these aren't really buttons, these are more of a placement area. This is where you would put your phone, your thumb, and stuff like that when you're walking. And this right, this square piece right here is the touchpad. This is where I will do all my swiping, double tapping, and different gestures and stuff like that that will connect the uh, cane to my app. It's, and so I can navigate with navigate using just the cane and it will um, communicate with my phone. This little round circle right here, this is the sensor. The sensor right here will um, detect anything obstacle wise above waist level. So as I'm walking, your cane gets the ground feedback. And this right here will go anything waist above, 
because you normally hold the handle of your cane to your waist. This will detect anything above, um, if there's low hanging branches, signs, or anything like that. And like I said, this is where you're screwing the thing piece in. I mean, I'll show you. It's just easy. Like, say if this is attached to the cane, just take it and give it a few quick spins. And it's attached. The cane is attached. Back here, there is a speaker with a microphone. Like I said, there is a um, assistive that you can say assistive where's the nearest place and it can help you but it's still in proto so this hasn't worked completely yet but there's a speaker and right here is the on and off button i'm going to go ahead and turn it on hear that little chime that little chime right there says that it is working that it's turned on and i will get into a more detail on how things work and also, I, what I did was actually swipe down with two fingers, which turned the um, audio detection on, so it's not vibrating right now. Uh, you just do it two more times. And you guys can't really hear it, maybe, but you're close enough. There is vibration. This will detect if there's something in the way, like as of right now, it's vibrating, since I don't have it connected to my phone. It, okay, turn off. M1, and this is this. Okay, I'm going to go ahead and turn it off, and you'll hear a little chime go down. It vibrates and goes a lower chiming down, so you know when it's off. Also, in the box comes a leather, a pleather, faux leather um, case, because you do not want to get this sensor wet right here, since this is the main technology of it all. So it does come with a nice little case, leather case that you just slip in and you can tighten it down using the uh, tightener. But I can also feel right here where my thumb would be. I can still do tight taps and stuff like that. But it just protects it so it doesn't get wet and ruined. But definitely, um, I have used it. So this is a already on box unboxing video i have used it for tried it out for some stuff but i can't wait to use it and show you guys more of my adventures with it it's more experience with it i've already taken my um onboarding class and stuff like that to know what the different signals are and everything like that so i can't wait to bring you guys some more if you guys haven't done so already make sure you hit that like button subscribe if you are new and all my links are in the description below. My Twitter, Instagram. If you'd like to help support the channel for me and my adventures, my PayPal will also be linked below. Thank you guys so much for joining me today. Can't wait to see you guys out there. And remember, live your life to the fullest, one day at a time. Talk to you guys later. Bye.